Check it out, we got a cap test here from the new line of Fresh Paint. I've got a bunch of assorted caps, and let's see which ones perform the best. Silver stock tip. Skinny stock tip. Universal outline. Iron Lack Sharpshooter. Gray Dot. Cyclone Fat. Blue Dot. Yero Fat. Rusto Fat locks up on the can. You can't spray with it. NY Fat. NY Skinny locks up on the can. Black on Black Skinny. Black on black fat, clear skinny, pink dot, iron lac vegan tip, German outline number one, Montana level one, Montana level two, Montana level three, Montana level four, Montana level 5 Montana level 6 Beige dot Needle cap Calligraphy tip So the fattest cap definitely has to go to Montana level 6. This one consistently crushes it on all my cap tests. It's by far one of the largest. It's probably about 5 or 6 inches tall with this uh, fresh paint can as well as it's a nice soft line and as you feel you'd probably take care of that. It wouldn't uh, have this negative space in there as well as it would definitely uh, be nice for flares and all that. The silver fat stock tip that came with the fresh paint can is definitely going to be my go-to for filling consistently at a fast rate. The paint came out really quickly but it was still manageable and as you can see it's got a really dark and consistent circle and it's going to be a really opaque and dump a lot of paint on the wall. There was no one skinniest cap for the fresh paint so I picked three that were best suited for it. So we got the Montana level one, we got the red stock tip as well as the German level one. So these three pretty much had the range of skinnies. Uh, they were all basically the same thickness, but I will say the Montana level one actually took advantage of the Fresh Paint's pressure the best. It was actually a pretty soft skinny line, so it didn't put out too much paint at once, which was really nice. Um, the stock tip in red did uh, push a little bit more paint out at a faster rate, I should say. And so that would uh, lead to a better chance of drippage and all that kind of stuff. But uh, the German level one was right snack dab in the middle. So there's kind of the range of them. I will say that the pressure being able to take advantage of that, this was not the only cap that uh, really slowed down the amount of paint that was coming out. A couple of the other European caps, uh, as you could see while I was spraying them, were a bit softer of a line. And uh, when you are doing a piece it, with a higher pressure can, like fresh paint, Caps that are able to take advantage of that really make this can uh, a versatile can. That's just another bonus for making these fresh paint cans really great. You can see they worked with basically every cap besides a few of the stem caps, but overall I really like how uh, the caps work and I'm excited to use them in the first impressions video. If you enjoyed the video or have some future suggestions for cap test videos, be sure to leave them in the comment section down below, as well as be sure to check out my first impressions and my swatch test. I actually did a swatch test of all the new 60 colors from fresh paint, as well as the first impressions of the new cans. So that's really going to do it for me guys. Peace.